Nowadays, people are willing to spend money for certain conveniences in life, whether it is cleaning the house, delivering groceries, or even walking the dog. But how many people would pay someone to stand in a line like this one? For sure, it's three hours. I would just pay anyone to just wait for me, at least. No, I wouldn't. Yeah, I'd rather wait here. Um, I'm not working yet, so. I feel like I would be on the opposite end. I feel like I would stand in this line for people. And this man is on to something. As lineups continue to grow at Service Canada's and Service Ontario's, people are looking to cash in on the inconvenience of standing in line. Ads are popping up on Facebook Marketplace and Kijiji offering the service of standing in line for a nominal fee, anywhere from 25 to $400 an hour. Because it's really boring just than here in line, honestly. I would pay $25, $25. Service Canada attributes the long wait times for passport services to an increase in demand for passports amid the easing of restrictions and the resumption of travel. Many have been taking to social media to share their gripes with long lineups, which piqued the interest of Julia Pack, a Toronto-based software developer developing a booking app. People don't really want to be waiting in line for all hours of the day. And also there's an element of there are some people that may need the money. And after spending more than three hours in line, this woman says it is a service she could get behind. If I knew that it was going to be this long, I would have been here like uh, six in the morning to be the first one there. <laughs> People are being reminded that if they do hire someone to stand in a lineup for them, that it is important not to share any personal information with them. Another tip, always try to check for references and validate that who you are booking is indeed a real person and not an online fraudster. I'll send it back to you in the studio.